Welcome to the audio excerpts of special seminars and conversations with Nalan Narula on gettingpositivekarmanow.com. There are no binding consequences in the terms of coming down here and you know going through lifetime after lifetime birth death old age and disease doesn't exist in the spiritual sky so that's not there transformations exist but not birth death old age and disease transformations as in uh, if krishna desires to interact with you uh, you know as a blade of grass you will become grass if he wants you to be a bumblebee you will become a bumblebee there's no birth and death is transformation zone and but everybody is in that m- connection or mood of that, that uh, you know serving for the pleasure of krishna and then he serves for you uh, also reciprocates that way so it's a ever increasing back and forth it's a reciprocal relationship in other parts of the spiritual sky and the outer world there are uh, different types of relationships with the divine there is the awe and reverence kind of relationship which will get you to the various vishnus and the vishnu tatva you know which are expansions from krishna which are expanded to balram from balram come all the other expansions of the male side and then there is radha rani on the left side and then other expansions are coming from her so it's that's a different universe it has different lo- rules and laws but one thing is for sure birth death old age and suffering is not there that's why it's called vaikuntha vaikuntha dham means where there is no kuntha where there is no lamentation it's lamentation free also plastic free <laughs> yeah mm-hmm. so <laughs> you are free there absolutely free to do what you are intrinsically dharmically your essential core position your essential core position either in this universe or the spiritual universe is only one which is that you are there to serve krishna or the divine the purpose of the divine here you are serving forcefully you are made to serve dhakke kha kha ke ha you are servant of everybody actually your family members you are serving them your job you are serving your company your boss your pro, you know whoever your coworkers as parents you are serving your children as pet owners you are serving your pets <laughs> so what makes you think you aren't a servant you are a servant either here or there better to be voluntary servant in the spiritual sky than this involuntary servitude is it not then give me an example where you are not a servant one please feel free to speak up hmm where are you not a servant here you are serving yourself my alarm <laughs> to go yeah this is a mechanical wrist watch it's a likultra which before it became jaeger likultra is the first mechanical alarm on a clock on a, on a watch it's a wind up watch very cute every 24 hours oh you set the alarm you, know, you can wind it up and it will buzz whenever you want it to buzz it's buzzing now so i wind it till buzz it's like moments, a little bee huh i'm sorry yes in just moments when you are enjoying yourself maybe probably watching a good movie or what are you enjoying who is enjoying you are serving your false ego <laughs> <laughs> how do we get it get connected as he said you do your healing so it's a good servant 
good service. <laughs> service you must do. That's the point. So the levels of service also make. Uh, yes, of course. Is. There are different levels of service. The levels of service are in the spiritual world. If you are serving something with a spiritual base, even here, so there is excellent. Then there is very excellent. Then there is most excellent. And then super most excellent. But they are all excellent. So this makes no difference. Okay. So is the interaction with the divine uh, changes because of these levels? No, how, it's not. It's, 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 this is just a relative thing. I mean, there's. A, I mean, if something is excellent, I mean, what more can you say about it? It's just right for that person, for that, for that soul, for that time and that place, and there is nothing better. If he is posted to a different position, then maybe he will interact differently. But it's all super excellent. I mean, it doesn't make any difference. It's not like the material world. It's very dif difficult to grasp when we are not having that experience or that practical understanding because there is no reference to it in the material world. Exactly. There is no exact reference. There is no exact reference. You can think about it in a, in a relative way. If something is... Okay, let, let me give you a material world reference. Think of 10,000 rupees. Is that something that you can understand, 10,000 rupees? Think of a hundred thousand. Think of fifty hundred thousand, fifty lakhs. One crore. Can you visualize and understand one crore? Up to what level can you understand? Then what about ten crores? <laughs> flying, flying high. Okay, now think of 1,000 crores. Does it make any difference? 1 million crores? <laughs> I mean, at some point, it, it makes, they're all the same. At some point, that level, do you understand what I'm saying now? So it makes no difference because it's everything is included, is so all-inclusive and so all-encompassing that it makes no difference. So that's infinite, infinity. You take infinity away from infinity, it is still infinite. So that's the divine. That's what happens in the divine world. So you can experience that while doing your healing. So you stay within the flow of healing and you will find infinity. You'll find the joy of infinity there. You've been listening to a discussion with Nala Narula on www.gettingpositivekarmanow.com.